Hi, what's up everybody, Scott here, and I have a Call of Duty Black Ops Domination on the map, Nuketown. That's... Did I, did I, did I just steal that? I think I, I think I just stole that. Um, sorry, didn't, didn't, this just kind of slipped out. I'm a big fan of White Boy, so, um, yeah, I think that. Sorry, okay, anyways, uh, we're going to be using the MP5K right before I get it gold, which is kind of stupid, so... But yeah, this is the gameplay right before I got the gold MP5, I believe. So, yeah. Um, perks, uh, Lightweight Pro, I believe, Side of Hem Pro, and Marathon Pro. And guess what just came out, guys? It's I know this is a um, Black Ops. Um, oh, look at me. Look at that. Oh, my. That was sweet. That, that This is why I'm choosing this gameplay. Um, it's not the best kills and deaths, but it's entertaining, because I do circles around these idiots, and I get commando lunge and everything, and it's just exciting. So anyways, uh, the, the new survival mode um, trailer for Modern Warfare 3 came out. Machinima has it up. If you guys want to go check that out, I'll leave an annotation or I'll post the link in the description. That way you can go check it out. If you guys already haven't, if you guys haven't seen it already, but it looks pretty sweet, guys. And I'm just gonna point out some of the things that I can remember from it. So, first off, it's somewhat like zombies. It's oh, duh, the survival, duh, kind of survive and yeah. Um, let's see, pointing out, pointing out. Model 1880, the whole, a whole bunch of uh, different weapons you can use. Um, there's a light machine gun that looks pretty cool. Now, I just want to uh, let you guys know that just because um, the iron sights might look weird, if you guys remember in Black Ops, the multiplayer preview, the iron sights looked really, really cool. But then when the game really came out, the iron sights didn't look nothing like the beta. So I just want to point that out for you guys. That just If you guys think that those are the iron sights, most likely they're not gonna be, but there's a, a small chance that they could be the real iron sights for the weapons. So, just gonna point that out. But in the first clip, there's an LMG and you're spraying down people. Um, and then there's so this LMG, shotguns, pistols, grenades, and everything. So, when you spawn in, instead of being, you know, I know it's not exactly like zombies, but you get like an aerial view of the map. And you go down like really, really fast, and all of a sudden you like, you stand up and you're holding your little pistol. I, I, I didn't get the name of the pistol. I can't remember it. The P99. Yeah. Okay, so it's probably a P99 or a P90 or a P90X. You know. Um. No, P90X is an exercise. Um. Whatever. Anyways, so and then you have it, and it has a lot of ammo, guys. I mean, what is it? Like, a hundred rounds in the pistol. I mean, in. And zombies, we only get, what, 40 to start off with, so, I mean, getting 100 rounds in your pistol, that's going to be a little interesting, just because, I mean, with a normal, <clears throat> excuse me, you know, in zombies, yeah, the first round, it's like a five, it's like a seven hit kill. In this game, it looks like it could be a five hit kill, um, so you're looking, you know, five hit kill with the pistol. Uh, the money thing, you're not going to be able to get money every um every time you get a kill like in zombies every like oh look at this this is nice he moves the sentry i'm just gonna shoot him knife the sentry and do a, a little circle here watch this shoot him and then i shoot the dude running away oh wow that that was that made my day that was pretty sweet and then i defend the b flag and everything so then i get a cobra and anyways um what was I talking about? I was talking about the pistol. So anyways, uh, or the, the point system, it looks like. So pretty much, you're not going to be able to get... I wasn't playing it with anybody. Just an FYI right here, uh, for your information. Uh, I wasn't playing with anybody. So that little blue arrow on my screen, he's a random. I don't know who he is. I don't know his name. don't know his address, his phone number, where he lives, his state, his country, whatever, whatever you want to call it. I don't know him at all. So, uh, so the point system. Um, it looks like that there is... You don't get points for killing a one person, okay? You get points for kill streaks and headshots. So let's say a headshot 
so many headshots it looks like maybe five headshots will bank you 500 bucks a uh, kill streak of five will bank you uh, a kill uh, you know 500 bucks again so if you get a uh, five kill streak five headshot kill streak I mean you're looking at a thousand bucks then at the end of the round it's like multiplayer we're in black ops at the end of the game you get a certain amount of COD points so in Modern Warfare 3 survival mode, after the end of the round, you're gonna, depending on how well you did during that round, I guess you're gonna get some COD points. So uh, that that's what it looks like. It's gonna work out. So, um, but the Model 1887s look really, really cool um, in survival, and I really hope that's what they look like in multiplayer too, because that'd be sweet. I love the models. I have only used them like three times, so. Yeah, I, I did well with them uh, in Modern Warfare 2 for the, like the four or five times I actually used them. But okay, um, now the next thing I want to talk about is the new like armory system where you actually go and buy your weapons. So pretty much you can buy weapons. It looks like buy weapons, grenades, and like kill streakable like airstrikes and everything during the round. So I mean, kind of like Black Ops where you buy stuff off the wall if you run out of trouble. Well, you have to run to a certain place and everything, so... I don't know if you can hear that. It was a paper crunch. I think my cat sat on something, um, but... I don't know. I don't see a cat, so... I don't know where she went, or he went. I got two cats, but... Anyways, let's stay on topic here. Stay on topic. So. Come on. Concentrate. Okay, um... This is a long domination. That's why I chose it to talk over, too, but... Okay. Um, so... Also in survival mode, it looks like that you can rank up separate from multiplayer. Now this is what I like. So every time you rank up, you're going to unlock something different, whether it be perks. So, you know, you're going to have like sit rep, last stand, and extreme conditioning once you rank up the first time. And you have all three of those perks on at the same time. So, I mean, it's not, you know, one third perk. It's a lot of third perks. So you might be looking at quite a few perks maybe you have maybe you have to change them out depending on what round you're at but okay um let's see the next thing so yeah you can level up and then during like the armory and everything oh another knife sentry kill oh that's two to this game <clears throat> so what am i talking about oh this is this is a nice clip i believe whatever it don't matter uh that's later on um the armory so in the armory this, this is actually another cool thing. When you're in the armory, you have the choice to share money. Share money. Yes, share money. So you can... I think it, it looks like it's going to be a maximum of 500 per round, maybe. Or per... Yeah, but I think per round would make sense. Because otherwise, that's going to be... Well, then again, it would make sense just in case, you know, you you're, you're, somebody dies or something. Or you... I don't know. But, yeah, you can share money. I don't know if anyone caught that, but you can share money uh, in this game for 500. I don't know. Again, I don't know the what it's going to be, but it's going to be 500 maybe per round or something. So you can help out your teammates get a weapon, uh, which is going to be nice because I, I countless times um, I open doors and zombies and I don't have enough to try at the box or I don't have enough to... Um, buy a weapon or buy another door so I mean this this will be nice um, but another thing uh, let's talk about something else um, so the airstrikes what I saw in the airstrikes there's there's a lot of different like equipment and everything I mean there's flashes grenades and everything but the interesting thing is I think mostly interesting is the um, the air the armory for the airstrikes and everything I mean there's um Countless, countless, uh, I don't know <laughs> what I'm saying, but there's a lot of different stuff. I mean, you can have like a bunch of riot shield dudes drop out of airplanes, and that would be very scary if that actually happened in multiplayer. I'm just saying, like, nobody, nobody wants six or seven riot shield dudes drop out of an attack helicopter and start walking towards you all in like a straight line where you cannot get at them. But also with the riot shields, the riot shields, oh, I'll talk about this in a bit, but um, but yeah, that's one thing, and then there's like an AC-130 strike where you throw down your smoke, maybe like 
it's like five thousand bucks or something maybe five to six hundred maybe i don't know to throw down to smoke and then this ac-130 in the sky just like obliterates that one spot you know like for like 15 seconds maybe i don't know or it it was just a small short clip in the uh, trailer but and then uh the enemies also have kill streaks too they have pavlos attack helicopters teams of juggernauts that just like you know they they're just grappling down from a, from uh, attack helicopters and pavlos, which is gonna be scary because in Spec Ops in uh, Modern Warfare 2, I you you got scared when a uh, juggernaut sound came, so that's gonna be um kind of hard to see. I, I don't know. It it'll be easy to see, but it'll be hard to take them down, I guess. But um yeah. So anyways, I mean. Juggernauts, I don't know if this is everything, but you can actually buy a riot shield. Oop, burp. Okay, but you can buy a riot shield that looks like maybe in the weapon armory. So, I mean, you can... You buy it, but if you get shot too much, the riot shield actually breaks. And you get you started getting hurt and everything, so... That that would be nice, because, I mean, in Mono for 2 multiplayer, you couldn't do anything. Oh, this is a nice clip to end the game. Um, I die though, but I was running circles around these guys for a while, so. But yeah, that's pretty much the take I have on the new Modern Warfare 3 survival mode um, trailer. So, I hope you guys enjoyed. I, I enjoyed it. I mean, I'm excited for Modern Warfare 3, but we'll see what happens. Okay, guys, so I'm out. I'll see you guys tomorrow. Peace.